when a high-end smartphone like the Galaxy S20 freezes at a certain screen, you can always expect it to be a software-related problem. However, if it gets stuck on a black screen, then there's a possibility that it's a hardware issue. As an owner, you should try to troubleshoot it to know what the issue is all about and how to fix it. So in this video, we will show you how to fix or reset a frozen Galaxy S20. First solution, force restart your phone. If your phone is stuck on an app or a certain screen, then the problem is pretty minor. In fact, you will be able to make your phone respond again by just doing this procedure. To force restart your phone, press and hold the volume down button and the power key for 10 seconds. This will trigger your device to shut down and power back up. When the logo shows, release both keys and wait until the device finishes the reboot. Even if your phone is stuck on a black screen and would no longer turn on for some reason, you have to do the same. Press and hold the volume down and power keys, and it will force your device to boot up. There's no guarantee that such a problem would never occur again. But if ever it happens to you in the future, then you just have to do the forced restart and it should be fixed. However, if your device is stuck on a black screen and won't respond even after doing the forced restart, then you have to do the next solution. Second solution, charge your phone and do the forced restart. You should do this procedure if your phone has died and won't respond anymore, because it's possible that it's due to a drained battery. Sometimes, the firmware may crash if you let your phone run out of juice. As a result, you'll be dealing with a couple of minor issues that both leave your phone unresponsive. To rule out such a possibility, here's what you should do. Plug power adapter to a working outlet. Connect your phone to the charger using the original charging cable. Regardless of whether the charging sign shows or not, leave the phone connected to the charger for at least 10 minutes. After that, press and hold the volume down button and the power key for 10 seconds. This will force your device to boot up. Once the logo shows, release both keys and allow the phone to continue the boot process. As long as you can make the logo show, that's a sign that the problem is fixed. However, if your Galaxy S20 is still stuck on a black screen and won't respond even after this, then it's time to have it checked. We hope that this simple troubleshooting guide has been helpful. Please support us by subscribing to our channel and enabling notifications. Thanks for watching.